Actually, I love his timbre. It sounds really soft, really calm, a bit airy, so calm, so tone. Such a great first phrase, such a calm, an amazing pitch. Well, technically, he's just be whispering a bit, touching the voice. Na, 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 na. Now he's just like beginning the story because he is completely relaxed singing the first phrase, guys. It's so different from the original. It's not what I was expecting at all. I know it said orchestra version, but um, it's just a lot softer and um, sweeter almost. And it's such a great love song too, you know, the chorus. It's, I don't want the world to see me. I don't think that they'd understand. But you want that one person to see you. And when you think about it in life, you know, it's just such a good song because how many people really know the real you? You know, people think they know you. They've got an idea of you. But there's very few people that actually touch your soul and uh, they know what you're actually about. Um, and when you find those people, it's like someone you want to hold on to, you know? So, it's such a good song. I'm so excited. All I can take is this moment And all I can breathe is your life And sooner or later it's over I just don't want me to die this is so beautiful. He even, in oh, oh, hold on, we're going back. He incorporated this beautiful, almost whimper sound, but I am blown away by just how tender his voice is right now. Lord, I'm sorry for the big for shouting and now crying. Oh wow, you, my husband's here in the side, and your eyes are all red. No, no. I heard his voice. Oh, like, yeah, I know. I, I, never, I, I, I proved the song, but I never went this. I didn't do this oh, my this husband only it. heard a little bit. He didn't hear so that bit, and he could he, hear it through here. When he hit that there, I was like, wow. I know. I am going to go back on... Oh, no, I don't need to. We're instrumental right now. Okay. Let me get my ish together. Incredible voice. And you can't fight the tears that ain't on me Or the moment of truth in your eyes And everything seems like a movie Yeah, you bleed just Great intensity, great vibrato. Dude's just a killer. I do wish there was some guitar and drums in this a little bit. Maybe it'll come in later. I am in love with these words. I'm not here anymore. I feel like my soul just lifted out of my body. I, I don't I don't know how to explain it, but 
Wow. The way he hit that note. Alanta is feeling the music. Okay, that was moving on two different levels. Oh my god. One, just the, the vote. The, it wasn't even. <laughs> I can't speak. The, the, the lyrics are usually what gets me on this song, but it didn't necessarily this time. It was, it was initially, and then it, it, was, it was just the vocals. It was the passion and the gut and the gumption in the vocals he meant every freaking word every word i remember when i first heard him do tennessee whiskey and i heard that rasp and i fell in love with it but oh my god Whew. my heart hurts right now wow that was by far the most theatrical cover I've heard of this song first of all second I haven't heard him sing with that high um, those high notes as high as that you know the vocal range he, he he expressed more of his capability in his vocal range in this one and the orchestra just made it even more uplifting and more you know it you just feel like you are floating whenever you hear a Chakra Khan sing and the sadness it's just so different when Chakra Khan sings it, you know? Wow, that makes my heart like really beat so fast because this song is already a sad song and, and it's about um, a lot to do with like depression and stuff and the fact that some of you have mentioned that Chakra Khan himself wasn't feeling so, so good um, recently. That's why he's doing some of these covers, but, but the emotion that he puts into his song it's like you can hear his heart itself that's what's amazing oh my god it's really deep emotional singing i can't remember right now he's using his belting with the tight throat just to create this open and bright song with the pain like be screaming with some husky colors in the in the sound you know that's why it looks really interesting it looks so I am stunned. Like, I recognize I'm a very emotive person. But that was shocking to me that, like, those two sounds that are so polar opposite came from the same person. Wow. I thought of the song Iris and I was like, oh, yeah, it's really, it's like that cool 90s emo sound, like Goo Goo Dolls. Absolutely. He's going to nail it. He did so much more than I could have ever anticipated with that song. I'm not even joking. After I saw him sing Tennessee Whiskey, 
I went online and I started looking up tour dates. I wondered if he was coming to America, if he was doing an international tour anytime soon, because I am so amazed by his vocal quality and his vocal ability. He stuns you with the tone, with the quality, with that core sound. 